Hey guys, Dark Spine Scott here. Uh, yeah, been a while, hasn't it? Uh, sorry for not making any videos in a while. I've just been lazy. <laughs> uh, sorry, but well, yeah, I've just been enjoying my summer, uh, and uh, I've just been working on sprites, really. But um, what I decided to do today is um, I'm gonna go over my top seven favorite uh, PS2 games. Uh, why top seven? Well, because, well, seven's a lucky number, I guess. So yeah, without further ado, uh, let's get on with this list. Starting with number seven, Apescape 3. Now, I've only played the uh, the second and third Apescape games. The second one's alright, but I don't think it's anything special. And I've been meaning to try out the first Apescape, but this Apescape is, uh, Apescape 3, I mean, is, uh, is really, really funny. Just like the whole different movie parodies, like Howler's Unmoving Castle, is really, it's really quite funny. Plus all the unique gadgets you get, and the, the special power-up suits, it's, it's a lot of fun, i got to say. Uh, yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, destroy all humans at number six. The the very first destroy all humans. Now, whenever when I heard about this game coming out, I was like, yes. I mean, there's so many games we playing the, the humans defending the earth. Now we get to be the aliens invading. And it's really quite a fun game. You get all these special psychic powers, uh, cool alien weaponry, and it's pretty fun missions. Quite hard, actually, as well, but, you know, it's mark of a good game if it's challenging. Uh, i got to say, though, this game is really hilarious, and it's kind of weird, actually, that, well, the alien sounds... It sounds a bit like Jack Black... Uh, Sorry, not Jack Black, uh, Jack Nicholson, if he was some sort of alien thing. Uh, if you watch it, then you'll um, you'll get the idea. But yeah, definitely worth a play. Number five, Yakuza, first game. Now, I will admit, I've only ever got into this series more recently, thanks to uh, Scotch Ducks Let's Play. Go watch his Let's Play. Okay, shameless plug over. Uh, yeah. Um, never was, it, it, it kind of seems a bit like a, a sort of GTA at first, it just set in uh, Japan, but not at all, I mean there's no driving really in it, or maybe except for one section, but that's not exactly driving, but, uh, roam around the city, beating the shit out of, um, street thugs, it's a really quite fun game, plus, uh, Really good story, really good story, and I'm really considering on uh, picking the sequel up. Of course, since I don't have a PS3, then I won't be able to play the third and fourth game. Damn it. But anyway, number four is Sly 2, Band of Thieves. Uh, I have uh, all three Sly games, and the first one was a good platformer, uh, but this... Um, I really like the sequel. The, the, I mean, the second one. It uh, was a lot of fun, you know, uh, doing the different variety of missions, getting to pickpocket to people was pretty fun. Plus, you get to play as uh, Bentley and Murray, which, you know, it's, it's pretty cool. They have their own unique traits, as it were. Uh, of course, they went a step further with that for Sly 3, making, like, loads of playable characters, which... Uh, I don't really like so much. But, so that's kind of why I'm putting Sly 2 on my list as my top, uh, number 4 in my top 7. Number 3 is Jack and Daxter, The Precursor Legacy. Like uh, the Sly games, I have uh, all three, well, all three of the main Jack games. Uh, Jack and Daxter, uh, first game, uh, Jack 2, and Jack 3. Now, uh, the reason I put this one on the top, well, above the other ones is, well, I don't know, this kind of felt like a more classic platformer. 
Because, I mean, don't get me wrong, the other games are good if not challenging. If not, well, challenging and just quite a bit too hard. I'm looking at you, Jack, too. Um, but, yeah, uh, this really felt more classic platform because, uh, you know, you're just going through levels collecting stuff. Uh, in the other games, it's more just uh, go do mission, then go... Uh, wander around the place, go do another mission, go to this point, do that mission, blah, 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 blah. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, plus this, this game was just really, really funny. You know, most of the humour coming from Daxter. Defin definitely, if you haven't played this already, then you really should. <laughs> and coming up to number two, it is... Ratchet and Clank 3. Um, and once again, have all three games. Ratchet and Clank, Ratchet and Clank 2, Ratchet and Clank 3. Now this, obviously, I find the best. The first game was a good start, but, you know, lacking a few things. Ratchet and Clank 2, it had some fun gameplay, but, uh, I don't know. It, it wasn't really that funny, and I don't really like the story that much. But the third game had it all. Good gameplay, good story, very funny humour, and yeah, just an overall good experience. Can't really say much more about it, except for the fact that, well, uh, Deadlock sucks. <laughs> Sorry, that game's cr I don't like that game. And uh, finally, for number one on my list is Psychonauts. Frigging love this game. This is just. Uh, I'm kind of lost words for this game. This, if you haven't heard of this game, then where have you been living? You need, you need to see, check out this game. Honestly, it's such a blast to play. It's got great story, great humor, great gameplay, and it's, overall, it's just amazing. You know, just. The, the fact that you can go into people's minds, they have different variety of different levels, each character is unique and has their own little developments, as it were. And plus the humour of it is just absolutely hilarious. Now, of course, the only gripe I've really got with this is since it's, well, my version of it seems to be a bit glitchy sometimes, like the music will, uh, I don't know, just sort of keep repeating its... At certain points, um, not sure. It's just, it just, it's just a minor gripe with it. But yeah, absolutely amazing game. One of my favourite games of all time. If you haven't played it, then um, out of all the the ones I've recommended on this list, I sincerely hope that you well recommend that you play this game. It is a ma well a major blast. Sounded lame. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's all I've got to say on that thing. Uh, hope you enjoyed this list. If well, this is my first time ever making this sort of a list. So if you if I've made a mistake or if you want to leave if you want to voice your own opinion, then please leave a comment in the below in the comment section below. So yeah, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, sorry for no videos, but I'll hopefully get back to that soon. Uh, I'm Dr. Spine Scott, and goodbye.